And we're back with the... Oh, I was about to say the longest journey, but no, that's the other game I'm playing. We're back with Broken Sword One: Shadows of the Templars. So now, after, so we're gonna do what we um what we talked about last. Go, George, go. What we talked about at the end of last episode, we're gonna go see the uh ah uh, the costume store, which was no, that's a police station. That's the cafe. Oh, La Risque du Monde. Hello. You've got some things out and about. Nothing extremely awesome, but uh, let's have a, a. Ooh, hello. What's this? Oh, that's a clown outfit. I gave the dummy Puro a tentative prod, but it didn't move. Oh. You know, just in as case it wasn't. I was about wasn't... to touch the dummy. <gasps> I realized it had the same color eyes as Nico. Oh god. Strange thing was, I hadn't realized I'd noticed the color of Nico's eyes. Or that I couldn't stop looking at them. Excuse me. Bonjour, monsieur. Please, come in. Welcome. I speak Leave French with a German accent. world behind. For in these four walls, fantasy is king. Uh, I don't want a costume. I do. Didn't you ever dress up when you were a child? Not that I remember. All the time. Incredible. You'll be telling me next that you never shared your elder sister's lingerie? Uh, I don't have a sister, and I think I'd look pretty silly in a brassiere. I just need some information. Of course. How can I help you? Uh, old man? Plantard, perhaps? Have you heard of a man named Plantard? I do not recall anyone of that name. Oh, uh, well, let's ask you about my inventory. Do you want this red nose back? Um, not after it's been worn, thank you. <sighs> What about this? Does this dirty tissue mean anything to you? Ew. Hmm. Let me smell that. Ew, why? Best Imer's number seven, white pancake. The You're a freak. Pink, right? Oh, oui, monsieur. La creme de la creme of Cespion accoutrement. Have you sold any of it recently? Yes, two can. To who? About this, I have all. All right. What about this? What does this tool mean to you? It is Nothing, a tool, Monsieur. Okay, let's ask you about the clown. I'm looking for a man who hired a clown costume from you. Oui, Monsieur. I do not see how I can help. Don't you keep a record of costumes that you've rented out? Of course, Monsieur. But uh... well, then mm -hmm. I'd like to check your records. Give me the names of everyone who's rented a clown suit. Impossible. There are too many. Oh no, what about this picture I have of him? Do you recognize this man? <gasps> Do you? Ah oui, he was here this morning. <gasps> he chose two costumes. Bozo the clown and Seamus the pixie. A pixie? Pixie. Very smart. Green silk with a taffeta lining. He gave me his name as Monsieur Khan. Yeah. Ah, oh, come on, that was obvious. Thanks for your help, buddy. <laughs> My pleasure, monsieur. Allow me to shake you by the hand. Uh, uh, uh well, okay. This, this doesn't sound right. I think we need an adult. Oh! You bastard. What are you trying to do, kill me? Yes. You did not find it amusing? No. I never saw the funny side of electroshock therapy. Eh bien, it is yours to keep. A gift? Do I need a license? <laughs> no, but I give you a word of warning, monsieur. What? Remember to switch it off before you visit the toilet. Ah! That's a horrifying message in my brain. Oh. Ah. Alright. Let's go ring some people. Where am um... Oh, you're back! Sorry I did not watch your hole. Your black hole! Hi! You're the guy who gave me the tip, aren't you? Huh? The racehorse, Salah Eddin. Oh, yeah, but... I put every franc I had on that horse. Oh. Listen, I... My lifetime savings, next month's rent, everything. <gasps> oh, God. He won by three lengths. <sighs> I'm a rich man. Call me Lucky George, the punter's friend. Uh. So how come you're still here? Oh, uh, I'm not going to let my newfound wealth change me, not one bit. I Aww. bought this hole, fittings and all. Now, I can come and go as I please. 
Put no more clocking on or completion schedules. No foreman breathing down my neck. You Thanks to you, I've found paradise. I'm getting a mushy feeling in my chest. But not half as mushy as your head. Yeah. You, what do you want now? You bought the hull? What do you make of this clown's nose? It would be more amusing if you were wearing it. Put it on, George. Put it on. Do you recognize the man in this photograph? No, I don't. What about this tool? I borrowed this tool from you while you were gone. Keep it. I can afford to buy a new set now. Okay. Would you like to shake hands with me? <laughs> no, I wouldn't. Aww. One of the real pleasures of being rich is not having to be polite. True, true. Do you recognize this tissue? Yeah. Certainly not. I gotta go. Yeah. Don't let me keep you. Yeah, have fun with your owl. I'm gonna use your phone. Uh, why did he draw that? I'm sorry, George. That's a lot of effort just for an address. All right, let's let's ring the Todrick. Hey, Todrick. Hello. Who is this? Mr. Todrick. Oh. It's you again. What now? I'm gonna ask you about a friend of yours. The man I'm looking for is called Khan. Khan! He bought a suit from you, remember? Mr. Khan. Khan! Yes. Right, all right, I'll stop, I'll stop. I remember him. Yes, I delivered the suit to his hotel. <laughs> the Hotel Ubu. Hmm. I uh, don't remember the room. Hmm. It was upstairs. The second room on the right hand side of the corridor. Thanks, Todrick. That's all I wanted to know. Now I've got you, Mr. Clown. <laughs> Mr. Clown. Am I gonna use your phone again? There was nothing inside the tent. No, I said the phone. George. You're an idiot. Ring Nico. Nico Collat. Bonjour. Couleur. Couleur. Hi, it's George. I have the address of the Cure's <gasps> Hotel. If you're going to pay him a visit, take care. Remember, that guy's a professional. Thanks. I'll be fine. Aww. Wait, that's a, that's it? Not even what you found out? The fact that his name was... Khan? Uh, uh, okay, I promise. No no more Khan jokes. But, um, luckily that this place here, I'm pretty sure, is the Hotel Ubu. Hi there. Remember me? Ah, mais oui, Inspector. Have you found him? Who? The man in the sewer, of course. Duh. I'm uh, sifting through the evidence. Ah, uh, rather you than me, monsieur. That reminds me, <gasps> someone's been impersonating you. They have? Came sniffing around just after you'd gone. Bored as brass. <gasps> he tried to tell me he was a policeman. Inspector or so, he claimed. I <laughs> didn't tell him I'd been talking to you. Not hours before. Thank yeah. Uh, impersonating a police officer is a serious offense. <laughs> a man with so little respect for the law must be desperate. Yes. Yes, my father used to say, desperation opens the door to the devil. The devil. He was always coming out with things like that. <laughs> Stupid man. <laughs> so, uh, uh, when you are not uh, exploring sewers, uh, what do you do? I take a lot of showers. Yeah, yeah. Oh, 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 oh very good, monsieur. <laughs> a policeman with a sense of humor. It wasn't that funny, man. It wasn't that funny. Take a look at this false nose. Oh. You showed me before, monsieur. Oh, that's right. Did I show you this tissue? Oh, we miss you. Ew. Shake my hand. Go on, shake it. <laughs> You're joking, aren't you? Yes. <laughs> Nothing personal. But you've been mucking about down this sewer. Aww. What about this? Did I show you my tool? <laughs> <laughs> Just like mine. Except <laughs> that it is much smaller. Oh, I see what you did there. Do you recognize the man in this photograph? Yes, I do. It's that villain I told you about. Do you recognize... Yes, that? I That's it? I have to be going. Good luck, Inspector. Oh, he's going. Well, this isn't the hotel, but what the hell am I thinking? We needed to speak to him for... No, we didn't need to speak to him. Oh, well. Alright, let's 
skirt of the hotel. Ubu. Alright, so here we are. Let's go inside. Or I suppose we could talk to these dudes. Hey, dudes. Excuse me. Hi. Oh. Yes? How are you? Have you heard of a guy called Plantar? No. That name means nothing to me. Nothing. I'm looking for a clown. I am are a clown. Are you trying to be fun? Yes. No, I really am looking for a clown. There are no clowns here except you. Burn! Do you know a man by the name of Khan? No, I don't. It's very important I get to see him, and... I told you. I, I don't, don't know, know him. Have you ever seen this clown's nose before? Ugh. No. What does this tissue mean to you? Are you serious? Yes. Oh, yes. Take a good look at the substance it's smeared with. Ew. You are sick. Very sick. Yes, George. Very sick. Will you shake my hand? Are you joking? Who knows where it has been? Where is my accent from? I don't know. What does this tool suggest to you? Hard label. <laughs> Do you recognize the guy in this photograph? No. I never saw it. Okay. Cool. Forget it. What's this say? And then we'll speak to Green Z. What? Ugh. Shrugger. Excuse me. Yeah? Yeah, what's it doing? Do you happen to know a guy named Khan? That ain't nobody I know. I'm sorry to be a burden on your brain. <laughs> you ever meet a guy called Plantow? No, I ain't. You missed your chance. Yeah. If you're quick, you'll catch him at the coroner's. Ugh. Have you Poor seen taste. a guy dressed as a clown? No, I ain't. Don't tell me I missed him. Oh, that's too bad. I love the clowns, don't you? I'm a child in a man's body. I love it when the little guys get hurt. Oh. Custard bites, hose pipe down the pants, then smack. A plant can the kiss them. Ew. Do you recognize this tissue? Think carefully now. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I'm gonna have to hurry ya. Ooh. Eh, uh. Time's up, so I'll tell ya. It's a used tissue with a liberal dump of Bestheimer's number 12. If you say so. <laughs> Shake, Shake my, my hand. hand. Go on. Ah. Oh, rats. What about this tool? What do these... Oh, never mind. What about this? Do you recognize the guy in this photograph? Is this a trick question? No, I simply asked if you recognized him. Okay then. No, I don't. Unless the trick is that later. his name is Trick. Not if you see me first. Uh, maybe, uh, what? <laughs> you have confused me. Oh, hello lady. I'd like some piano, please. Hi there, ma'am. Well, hello. What can I do for you? I'm looking for a man. You disappoint me, my dear. Oh. For one foolish moment, I thought. But never mind. Anyone else Aren't reminded of Lady Lily Howard? Uh, George. Uh, George Stobart, ma'am. How sweet! Oh, I God. once had a stable boy called George. I imagine. I am Lady Piemont. The common reaction is to kneel and stutter, but it's not obligatory. A real mm. lady? I mean, you're an honest-to-God aristocrat? Oh, I don't know about that. Few of my ancestors are honest, not even to God. Oof. I can trace my family back to the Normans, but don't let that intimidate you, George. Beneath mm. that impressive pedigree, I'm just flesh and blood. And I want your The blood flesh may be blue, blood. but the flesh is the plump beef of old England. So to speak. Oh. You appear distracted, George. Is there any way I can help you? Uh, um, Khan? I'm looking for a murderer. <laughs> Good heaven! You're a private detective. Yeah, That's so correct, ma'am. What's the term you Americans use? Oh, it's God. It's on the tip of oh. my tongue. Oh, I believe what you're thinking oh. of is dick. I think that's Precisely. what she wants on the tip of her tongue. Ugh. 